Hello, friends. I welcome you to a new day. Jesus is Lord. His government is forever. Let's just go ahead and appreciate him. Let's give him all the glory, all the praise. Father, we have come to register our presence before your majesty and to tell you we are grateful. Thank you for giving us life. Thank you for your message that endureth forever. We bless you, the Lion of the tribe of Judah, the one that rises in the heavens by the name Jehovah. We give you all the praise and we give you all the worship. Sweet Holy Spirit, we honor you and we bless you and we say you are welcome in a new day. Hallowed be your name. In Jesus' awesome name, we worship. Amen. Today is the 66th of Spirit Praise. And Spirit Praise comes your way every morning to build up your spiritual capacity and network. It comes as a daily dose to strengthen your spiritual cables and wires and to keep you ablaze for God all day. Briefly this morning, we take our Bible reading from Hebrews 11, verse 1. Now, faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. Friends, I would like to say that faith should be the lifestyle and pattern of every believer. My simple definition of faith is believing that you already have that which you have not seen. So faith is all about the ability of God and the weight of your confidence in God's ability. That's my simple definition. So as a Christian, Faith is a daily indispensable commodity you need to live a victorious Christian life. Why did I say so? Hebrews 11 verse 6 says, But without faith, it is impossible to please him. For he that cometh to God must believe that he is, and that he is a rewarder of them that diligently seek him. Someone once said that faith is the kingdom currency. And I tend to agree with him. He said, in America, dollar is the currency. In Britain, pound sterling is the currency. In Europe, euro is the currency. In Nigeria, naira is the currency. In Canada, Canadian dollar is also the currency and so on. But when you become a child of God, faith becomes the kingdom currency that is required of you for every kingdom transaction. Faith keeps you in a domain and with faith, you can conquer fear. You can live a victorious Christian life. Why did I say you can conquer fear? Because faith is the opposite of fear. And fear is the opposite of faith. So this morning, I pray for somebody listening to this broadcast that you will place a demand for the kingdom currency. And God will grant you that kingdom currency, which is faith, in the name of Jesus. Amen. And for you, who already has this kingdom currency, that God will enlarge your faith beyond where you are today. In Jesus' name. Amen. Let us pray. Since let's go in the Holy Ghost. Miliak Agadaba Legedesh. Zinekele Ketepeliak Agadadaba Legedede Lagadabash. Place demand for the kingdom currency. Ah. Likekekekekekeke Lakuta Papa Lekete Paliak Agadaba Legedesh. Zodebe Liagadaba Legedesh. It will help you to live a victorious Christian life on daily basis. Pray in the Holy Ghost. Makian de Regedesh. Zike legede de mos indra gadaba liga la gadaba legede de legede. Zukete pelia kagadaba ba legede de legede. Zodebe belegede de 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 legede. Zinde regede de legede de bos indra gadaba. Jakata palia kagadaba legede de legede. Zike legede de belegede de legede. Zondo rogodo de bos ikala gadaba la gada. Zekete palia kagadaba la gada la gada. Zekata tapia kagadaba bos. Shante regede de legede de legede de legede bos. Shanda. I pray for you this morning. Kalia kagadaba legede lagadabash. I have listened to this broadcast that your faith shall be quickened in the name that is above every other name. Lina kalia kagadaba legede lagadabash. For we prayed 
in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Have a victorious day ahead. I'm the center of it all. It's you that I see. It's you that I see. Oh, I'm the center of it all. It's you that I see. It's you that I. See.